I got an email from the College of Arts and Sciences with a list of um, opportunities for the, over the spring break. What got my attention was that they were looking for our interests first and how, made a list of what we were interested in and then they chose the job shadows according to that. Being a junior it's not a spring break where I'm going to a tropical place so I didn't really have anything planned um, so it was a nice little getaway to go to New York um, and network while I was there. Well Robert works at PWC in New York City so I met near his office because it was like a Tuesday and he was um, at some coffee shop and it was just like a really nice like informal chat. I visited Leo Wong at Daroga 5 in New York. It's an advertising agency. I chose Venture for America because it's based on like opening your own business and stuff and I would like to open my own business in the future. I chose a job shadow with the Bizzuto Group which is a real estate company. Uh, in outside of DC. I knew I had a little bit of interest in real estate, but I wasn't really sure, and this was kind of the opportunity for me to really kind of validate that I wanted to do that, and then it eventually led to an internship, which was great. He was just, he was kind of my resource. Anything that I wanted to ask him, I was more than welcome to. He like eased a lot of my stress about like entering the real world, but also like kind of prepared me with like things that he learned. I mean, they were all in our shoes at one point, and they understand what like the purpose of like job shadows and interning is, so they want to help you just like as they would want to been helped in the past. So just meeting with someone through Syracuse was helpful because it's already like we have one thing in common. Uh, I thought it was a great experience, uh, something that I think everyone should take advantage of. It was fabulous. Even though I'm on break, I'm still doing something positive for myself besides just sleeping, you know? I think growing up, my dad was always saying like, Whoever you, you'll get ahead in life with the people that you know. Um, and so I think having the alumni from Syracuse is very helpful and it's a little less intimidating because you have something in common that you both went to SU. Um, so it's a lot easier for me to talk to alumni. Just, it's not like a cold call, like, hi, I'm Kaylee, but um, you have something in common.